Some foreign media outlets claimed recently that China is now test flying another tailless stealthy combat jet, one that is different from the two types of alleged sixth generation fighter jets that were first spotted in December last year. Foreign media speculated that this new aircraft could be a crude fighter or a loyal wingman type drone. If confirmed, the aircraft, whether a manned fighter or drone, would be another manifestation of China's high technological level in terms of military aviation, a Chinese expert said. A mysterious tailless stealth jet spotted in China has intensified the US-China race for sixth-generation air dominance, where competing ambitions face significant technological and operational uncertainties on both sides of the Pacific. This month, multiple media sources reported that images circulating on Chinese social media appear to show a previously unknown tailless stealth aircraft, igniting debate over whether it is China's third distinct sixth-generation crude fighter or a high-performance autonomous loyal wingman drone. The war zone said that a high-performance, highly autonomous uncrewed combat air vehicle with collaborative loyal wingman capabilities is a major possibility, while based on the design, could very well be yet another sixth-generation crewed jet. Photographed from multiple angles, the jet features a pointed nose, mid-set highly swept wings with crop tips, no vertical stabilizers and possibly twin engines design traits suggesting either a Chengdu-built rival to Shenyang's J-50 fighter or an advanced unmanned combat air vehicle. The lack of clear cockpit imagery leaves its role unresolved. Analysts note similarities to China's massive J-36 stealth jet, but on a smaller, potentially faster airframe, with landing and nose gear hinting at carrier operations. The emergence comes amid a rapid expansion of Chinese military aerospace programs, including multiple collaborative combat aircraft designs and formally dubbed teacups that could debut at China's September 3 Victory Day parade marking the 80th anniversary of the end of World War II. These developments parallel U.S. efforts under its next-generation air dominance program, underscoring intensifying competition to field stealthy, AI-enabled platforms capable of operating in crude uncrewed teams for long-range, high-survivability missions. Carrier integration is a primary focus for China's next-generation designs. The South China Morning Post reported in April 2025 that China's J-36 stealth fighter design team is developing a carrier landing assist system for a planned naval variant of the tri-engine, tailless flying wing jet. Detailed in Acta Aeronautica et Astronautica Sinica, the system uses direct force control to adjust lift independently of pitch, aided by a fixed-time disturbance observer that counters turbulent ship airwake effects in real time, as stated by SCMP. Fu Qianxiao, a Chinese military affairs expert, told the Global Times on Tuesday that if these media reports are confirmed, this new aircraft would further demonstrate China's advanced technological capabilities in tailless stealth aircraft design. Being tailless means the aircraft lacks vertical stabilizers. While this design reduces radar cross-section and enhances all aspect stealth capabilities, it simultaneously demands advanced flight control systems to maintain maneuverability, Fu said. China is at a world-leading position in these aspects. According to SCMP, the technology integrated with 3D thrust vectoring and drag rudders achieved 2 cm altitude precision in simulations under extreme sea states. Such precision could allow sixth-generation flying wing aircraft to operate from China's carriers, extending the People's Liberation Army Navy's reach into blue waters, a capability that would advance Beijing's long-stated objective of sustained power projection. U.S. efforts, meanwhile, remain at the conceptual level amid secrecy and internal debate. David Batchy wrote in a March 2025 article for The Conversation that sixth-generation fighters mark a shift from raw performance toward operational dominance through integrated systems. He said they prioritize stealth evolution diamond-shaped airframes, radar-absorbing materials, and reduced or eliminated vertical tails enhanced by thrust vectoring and fluidic actuators for control. While fighter speed and maneuverability have plateaued, Batchy noted that onboard AI, adaptive engines, and manned-unmanned teaming redefine combat roles, enabling these fighters to operate as network nodes in a battle space. Leveraging sensor fusion and electronic warfare, they aim to outpace adversaries' decision cycles, with survivability, autonomy and seamless integration as central goals. China's unveiling of several new generation fighter types, such as the J-36, J-50, and possibly this new model, could also herald structural changes in the People's Liberation Army Air Force. Lauren Edson and Philip Saunders wrote in a July 2025 Joint Force Quarterly article that once these prototypes mature, the PLA Air Force may have to decide on the right mix of expensive, high-tech sixth-generation fighters and less costly fourth- and fifth-generation aircraft. 
Technical details underscore the scope of these decisions. Jane's reported in January 2025 that the J-36 is a tailless, tri-engine strike platform with compound diamond delta wings, carrot-shaped intakes and split rudders, featuring large internal bays capable of carrying very long-range air-to-air missiles and cruise missiles, suggesting long-range, high-speed strike capability. Jane's also described the J-50 as a twin-engine fighter with diverterless supersonic inlet intakes, droop wingtips and AI-enabled systems, possibly incorporating adaptive engines and manned-unmanned teaming. Both platforms, Jane's assessed, reflect China's intent to rival Western sixth-generation programs. The Aviationist, another foreign media focusing on military aviation, said in a report on Tuesday that the images confirm a two-segment trailing edge, with a straight center section that sharply angles outward before extending to the wingtips. The two inlets suggest a dual-engine aircraft. The slender probe on the nose is classic first flight kit. Above it, there might be a cockpit with a canopy although this is not clear, read the report. The Global Times cannot independently verify the authenticity of the images. China has not announced the development of the reported new aircraft, nor has it officially acknowledged the existence of the two alleged sixth-generation fighter jets that emerged previously. While no official announcement has been made regarding this specific new stealth jet, China has indeed been actively developing loyal wingman aircraft. This genre of drones can accompany crewed aircraft and provide it with support, including in terms of intelligence, information and firepower. At Airshow China 2022, the FH-97A Loyal Wingman drone made its debut. Designer of the drone told the Global Times at the time that Loyal Wingman is a key hot topic in the field of drones in recent years, and is widely considered to be an important part of the future unmanned combat system. It is the drone industry's general belief that loyal wingmen are expected to greatly change the pattern of conventional manned air combat by creating a new niche in the air combat system. According to its developer, the FH-97A can carry out collaborative reconnaissance with crewed special mission aircraft and fighter jet, providing early warning, reconnaissance, jamming support, target guidance, or serving as an ammunition depot for crewed aircraft. It can extend a pilot's situational awareness and scope of attack.